Hey guys, so today we are going to do a video about how to make a, a frameless setup. Very simple, very quick. I'm going to do it uh, very quick. And um, I did this in the past and I want to show you again. So what we need here is a um, jig. This is a simple jig uh, with uh, two clamps and a piece of wood like that. I use these pouches, but you can use any pouch you want. I use this one um, for um, tying the tubes. Uh, I found this is a great, a great material to tie. You can use the flat one, the band one. You can use a string. I used string for many years. And a scissor, and uh, maybe this one, a piece of string or whatever and uh, that's it so what we are going to use i'm going to use this tube 1632 i should um i should 516 steel balls you can see here how many i have i have also uh seven millimeters here uh but uh 516 eight millimeters is what i like and I'm shooting 1632 JZK um, tubes. I found this one to be the best. I tried many other brands, and um, and some they were great from AliExpress or from even from Amazon. They were great. I couldn't find any more. I, I tried this one. Very. I love these things. The only problem is their um, shipping policies that uh, you had to reach on a certain amount. So. I'm always looking for other sources. Um, I try other brands like Simple Shot, the black ones. I didn't like it much, uh, but um, every person has different opinions, right? So uh, one thing can be great for one person, another thing can be not. Uh, for this reason, there are many products, and everyone uh, could cover a certain groups of people, okay? So let's do it. Then... Uh, whatever length you, you you need to use, I do this. Cut a little piece, uh, whatever length you need, and I tie a knot. I tie a knot, and I will show you. I will show you why after. A simple knot. Um, I don't see. I didn't see many people. I did well. Actually, I didn't see anyone doing this beside me uh, before. So I've, I've done it for many years and I, I like this way. So simple as that. Now I take this thing, put it through the, through the pouch because it's kind of tight. Take, take the tube, go straight like that. Remember, the band has to go from the outside, huh? from the outside like this. Huh? And... Um, and I put I put the two sides in right away. Oh, I forgot one thing. <laughs> I have to sign. I have to sign the length that you want. In my case, I want nine. I want nine and a half. Nine and a half is what I want. One nine and a half from the north. North. To where the pouch has to start, more or less. Eh? Okay, let's do it again. So, take it inside, put it in, like that. How is it? Oh, there's no cooperating here for the TV. There you go. Go in, one. Another one inside. Put it in. There we go. Done. You go on your mark. You want it. And you have to make sure that everything has to be nice and straight. So this one has to go like that. And this one has to go like this. Like that. Okay. You check again. Check again. More or less, you can bend it. Yeah, like that. Okay, now, now you fold this one. 
Hold this one, and you pinch it. Pinch in the first clamp, that's it. Now there is a little hole here in the middle of the pouch. I put this thing in the pouch, like that. And I, I'm going to the other clamp, and I give a little pull, straight, like that. A little pull. If the pouch is um, twisted, you can move these ones and make it flat. Now I take a little piece of this, tuck this, and you go, you pull it, and you go around 10 times. 10 times, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Okay, now we go, we are going to do a, a simple knot. One, one, and pulling, eh? Always remember, remember always to, or remember always to pull. Right there, that's it. Cut this one, cut the other one, open this one and check check okay remove again this one and check the still everything is nice and and uh, and flat it's good and uh, and check the everything could be nice all right for this one put it in here and again do the same thing Pull it a little, a little pull, not much. There, okay. Take another piece. Take another piece. And we do it again. I like tubes. I, I, I use bands, but uh, five, six. I don't remember. Seven, <laughs> eight, nine, ten. Okay, here we go, here we go, and that one, nice in the middle, and now we go this side, there, pull, nice and tight, not too much, there, little, little, little part, open up, and check, Good. You see how nice the state? See how nice the state? Nice and flat. Perfect. Give a little pull to see if everything is nice. And uh, cut off those little things. And uh, nice. Let's see. Let's make a little pull to see. Okay. And now we can cut these ones. Not too close, not too long. I don't know. More or less. Here, I leave a little bit like that. There. There you go. This is the frame done. The frameless setup done is nice and you make a nice loop round. And there is a knot. Why there is a knot? So you want to keep uh, you want to keep your uh, frameless your setup in your ring finger or wherever you want to use it. Some people use it like that. I use it in the ring. So the important is the, the, the hand is to be in the middle. Otherwise, if you shoot like this, even if a little bit I exaggerate, then the pouch is not straight. So you want to, you want to be in the middle. So I do this knot, so there is always a V. There is, it makes a V. So every time I go there, I'm always already. I'm already there in the middle, so I'm I'm ready to to shoot. You can also put your um, your pinky there. It, may, it basically makes like a like a like a ring. So even if you look, if you let it go, it won't uh, it won't go away. I don't use that way. I just put my finger there, so I don't have to worry about search, always looking for the middle or something. I just Hold it there like this, and uh, and shoot. 
So the, the tubes, when you are going to make the first, the, this setup, they are going to be slippery because they are brand new. After you shoot for, uh, for a little bit, you will see they are going to be more sticky. So they will be easier to keep on your, on your hands. Okay, so let me move, uh, let's move the camera and I make a couple of shots with this uh, new one that I make. Um, outside is raining, so we're going to try to try this new one and show you uh, how it shoots. Hey guys, so here we are. This is the, the setup that we just built. And um, this pouch, the knots, and the knot here. What I use for my draw length is nine and a half from uh, the beginning of the pouch here to the knot active length whatever you, you want to use I will suggest you I'm not one of those guys that, that goes with uh, mathematical things I go for feeling so what I will suggest you is don't do the knot first time just do a, a loop if you are a beginner you don't know your length just do a longer loop and after you you start shooting whatever you distance you want to do uh, your um, distance of your draw length you want to do and maybe you feel oh no it's too weak then you cut just one side cut one side again pull it a little and uh, make another knot and try it oh it's better but maybe a little bit shorter so you cut again pull it and make a line until you find the perfect length uh, maybe maybe you cut it too short and will snap your hands or whatever then it's too short because there is too much power left. So whatever you want to do, you want to, for your technique, start long and go short. And when you reach the, the perfect balance, you measure from the beginning to your knot, then you know more or less your length, then next time you can do the knot. Okay? And uh, this is a good, uh, good tip. So let's try, this is the first shot. Um, sometimes they need a little bit of uh, uh, set set up setting. I don't know how to say. Let's try. That's good. That's good. It's a good feeling. Okay. Everything works fine. It's nice, and I hope you you will try it. And uh, always remember. Always remember, give a little, uh, a little, oh, the, the, give a little pull first. Give a little pull so the bands they won't move, and then you you pull and you open up, and you open up like that. Okay. Pull a little and then you open, and uh, and uh, you will be good. Okay. Yeah, it works. Uh, it works. Hey guys, here I am again. So let's try again a couple of shots. I put two matches there. Uh, remember, you take your frameless, give a little pull, and um, you pull a little. There you go, two matches gone. So, try it, have fun, and I uh, hope to see you soon. Eh? It's raining outside.